Hey, this is Hamid from Civil Engineering Philosophy Channel. In this video, we're going to try a new game, which is called Trust Me. And I always say that the best way to learn something is through games. So this game was actually designed by an aerospace engineer at Georgia Tech. His name is Julian Rimoli. This is his profile if you're interested to know more about him. So this game is about structural optimization, and I will tell you what it means exactly. Structural optimization or optimization in general is in general is the ability to use the least amount of resources to achieve something. So you start with something, a structural design or anything else, and you try to reduce the amount of material that you're using in this uh, structures or system in order to achieve more efficiency, more optimization. In this case, we're trying to change the shape of the structural elements in order to achieve that. So let's let's see that in action okay so let's open the game uh, when you open the game you have two uh, modes either freestyle or challenges i will start with the challenges you can check the free mode later so let's uh, start with the challenges so you pick the first challenge let's say i pick this challenge so we're trying to keep that weight you know the weight w we're trying to keep it there without falling so we need to construct some stuff we need to connect it to some elements to beams uh, to trust uh, to trust elements and you know the trust elements are either in compression or in tension or they are zero uh, members they don't carry anything any force um, so let's start by adding this member let's add the a member from on the left from here we press here and we connect it to here so that's the first member and if we run it now you see this button if we run it now it will just keep going back and forth and this is not what we want so my score you will see the score um, in the upper part of the screen it's zero so i didn't achieve anything we need to keep it hanging we don't want it to fall so let's start again so let's connect another element from the other side on the right side from here to here and then i run it and now it keeps hanging it's good but look at how many kilograms I have used. Here, the structure mass is 12.5 kilograms. And we're trying to achieve optimization, if you remember. So let's try to make these members thinner, okay? Let's try to make them thinner. So if I press here, you see that button here, and I press on the member, and I press on the member here, it's, it's becoming thinner. And look at the mass of the structure. Now it's 6.3 kilograms. And it's achieving, maybe, maybe it will achieve the same purpose, which is keeping that thing dangling and hanging without falling. So let's try now. Play. And it's good. By the way, the colors are red. Red means tension. And blue later, if we can see that, uh, tension, uh, blue is compression. So that's good. But I can still make it thinner because my score is 400. I, 399, I can achieve even more score. The more optimization that you do, the less material you use, or the less mass you use, it means you have achieved more optimization. So let's just try, try to make them thinner. Let's see what's the limit. Thinner and thinner. Now the mass is 3.1 kilogram of the whole structure, and we run it. It's still hanging, and that's great. So my score is 799. So that's a great thing, okay? Let's move on to the next uh, challenge. So the idea is don't buckle. Buckling, you know, when members are co are subjected to compression, they bend like that suddenly or sway uh, laterally, which is, that's buckling. So compression members uh, usually undergo uh, buckling. So let's try to prevent this these two members that we are gonna connect from buckling. Uh, so let's add members. So here, uh, the same thing, but in the opposite direction, the upper direction, and connect them like that. And the mass, as usual, 12.5. We start by 12.5 because it's the same members, but flipped. And let's run it. That's good. You see, tension uh, is blue. And let's try to make them thinner and thinner. Okay. So it buckles. Um, so the limit, we cannot make them thinner, so we need to go back and make them wider. And now it runs. Uh, to be honest, I don't know what's the best way to optimize this thing, but for me, this is a very low score. 200 is a very low score. Let's try if we can do something else. Let's try. Let's try. And make this thinner. Connect these two together. We can add 
a node here, by the way, if you if you add a node on a compression member, you make it smaller, which means you have less uh, probability or less, uh, it will be less susceptible to buckling. So let's try that. Let's add a node here, and a node here, and a node here. And let's connect them together. And I'm gonna make all of these thinner, thinner, thinner. And it's 17 kilograms, okay? So let me try to make them even thinner here. Okay. And let's make this thinner, 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 thinner. And play now. It, it buckled again. So let me try to make this thinner, but make this wider. And we try now. So it's 11.6. So you see, I'm even moving down, but not much, okay? So yeah, you can play around with this, uh, with this game. Uh, that, let's try another challenge. Let's go to challenge three. Um, this is a roller. A roller is different. The pin is something that is fixed like that to the ground or stick to something. But the uh, the member that is connected to it can move, can rotate in any direction, but it cannot move. Okay. The roller is something, the same thing, the same concept, but it also can roll. It's a roller. It's like a wheel thing. So let's uh, try to do this and that. And let's play it now. And you see what happens. So you need to add something to prevent it from rolling, okay? And uh, so let's uh, try this, add a member like that. And this member will be subjected to compression, right? So it buckles. So let's uh, try to make it, let's try to make these thinner because when we make these thinner, we will have less weight imposed on the compression member. So let's try to make this thinner and this thinner. Okay, let's try this thinner. Let me make these thinner, thinner. Uh, make this wider It buckles again. Let me add a node here. Try to add a node here. Sorry add a node here Exactly in the middle. Let's try that and add a member here Make it thinner 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 and play now 9.1 kilograms we can even move more because now it has a node which means we have uh, bracing so let's try that now. Oh, it buckles. And uh, what else can we try? Let's uh, try to add nodes here as well. Let me try to add a node here and a node here. Let's uh, try that. And we add a member here, a member here, and make them thinner, thinner, and try that. It buckles again. Let me then remove the... Um, I don't know. Let's try this. If we remove the nodes, we need to make this thicker. So we're going back to the same old thing. So there should be a way. So the best way, in my opinion, until now, but definitely there is more optimization than that. I'm 100% sure. Um, we connect this to that. And we can... The node is a little bit downward. You can move it upward. So... I achieved 215 in this challenge. So I want you to download the game and try it yourself and try to achieve the highest optimization or the lowest weight, okay? And when you finish that, please mention in the comment how much you achieved in the three challenges now. If you're interested in seeing more videos about this game, I will do more videos, of course, because it's so interesting and it makes you understand the concepts. I will put some links in the description about the professor's um, profile and I will put what he talked about it, how he designed other stuff using uh, this, uh, how he taught his students how to design stuff using uh, this game. So yeah, uh, also if you have any suggestions um, about other games, please let me know. And yeah, don't forget to tell me your score and how you achieved optimization in these three challenges. So yeah, that's it about this video. Thanks for watching and see you. Peace.